Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Deus Ex. Last episode we went through the streets of Paris and we have ended up in the catacombs where we are searching for Silhouette. The reports I am finding indicate a siege on the catacombs. MJ-12 must be trying to drive Silhouette from their hideout. So Tracer Tong has pretty much given you the information there. We're here to find Silhouette, and they are hidden somewhere in here. Now this is a really, really hard... Something creeps me out about Hella. I don't know. She's from high command. They're all like that. I think she really gets off being down here. Have you seen the little nest she set up in the room with the pillars? The command post? She does seem to be in her element. Curling up in her nest like a harpy? Man, I'll be glad to get out of here. Me too. I don't like tunnels. Always sounds like someone's sneaking up on you. Someone's there. I can hear you. Yes, yeah, so this level's going to be... Wait for him to move again. Very, very difficult. Yeah, false alarm, I guess. Did I miss my dart. Fucking hell. Oh my God. It's Denton. Remember the briefing. That's retarded. But yeah. Check your sit. Gotcha. Uh, especially He's if you're trying air. to do a pacifist run, this is. I'm pulling back. Probably the hardest level so far. And this guy's a flamethrower, so I don't really want to miss. It. There you go. The dart and the balls. Let's him off. It's Denton. Remember the briefing. We're gonna need some reinforcements. Ooh. And the other guy is also unconscious. Cool. Now it seems that we're always one step behind. Yeah, thanks for interrupting me there, Tong. But yeah, as I was saying, the MJ-12 always seem to be one step ahead of us somehow. They know where Silhouette's hanging out, and we're always the second ones to get there. I mean, like, oh shit. It just seems a bit suspicious is all. Just saying. I'm not trying to uh, foreshadow anything. Now these bastards uh, absorb tranquilizer darts, so... <laughs> The only thing you can do about them is to wallop them in the face with the dragon tooth sword. You're close to the bunker where Silhouette has barricaded themselves. The leader's name is Chad. Strange. The area looks different than it does on my map. Some new construction. Maybe they've concealed themselves from Majestic 12. Yeah, well, uh, I wonder how we get in there. Hmm. Yeah. How will we ever solve this fucking high-class mystery? Uh, we'll just push the very obvious brick and a secret door appears. Fuck yeah, that is hideout design. You found the bunker. I did. And I'm surprised no one else has with that fucking obvious entrance. Catacombs closed to public. Paris investigator. Investigator. The government announced today that the famous Paris catacombs would be closed to the public until further notice, citing increased criminal activity and possible terrorist connections to the area. 
The catacombs have become a haven for any number of unseemly elements, said Inspector Gabilly of the Metropolitan Police, and we are taking all necessary steps to contain this threat to the peace and welfare of Paris citizens. The catacombs are part of an un extensive network of tunnels that mostly lie beneath the 5th, 6th and 14th arrondissements, originally part of a large excavation taken by the Romans to remove valuable deposits of gypsum and limestone from the area. The catacombs themselves date back to 1786 when bones were removed from the grossly overcrowded Cemetery of Innocence to be stored in the quarries of Mount Mont Rouge. Since that time, innumerable additional burials have resulted in the vast ossuary that exists today. The publicly accessible sections of the catacombs are only a small part of the complete tunnel system, whose many entrances and exits have made it a popular diversion for cataphiles wishing to explore the underground history of the city. Oh lord, the fucking vocabulary in these newspapers, I swear. Especially for a French newspaper, it's all fucking... Uh... Higher... Make sure they don't follow you. Higher English vernacular. I mean, if the sorts of language they used in these fucking newspapers were here... I'm JC Denton. You might know my brother Paul. I helped him send your group a warning about the crackdown. Denton? Hmm, yes, the satellite transmission saved us from La Prison de France, at least. Pretty much a skeleton crew you have here. How long can your people hold off MJ-12? We are not mercenaries. When the troopers moved into the crypts, half of my people retreated without firing a shot. Two of them took a wrong turn and were taken prisoner. Where? In Bunker 3, the tunnels behind the second blast door. Maybe I can help you out in exchange for a small favor. I need to find Nicolette Duclair. Nicolette? What do you want with Nicolette? I need to contact some friends of her mother's. Oh yes, Beth, a great woman. Nicolette is very secretive about her mother's friends. She tells us that they are wealthy and support our cause, but they have many enemies and need to be protected. I might be able to help you, but I, I must be certain of your loyalty. You have a right to be cautious. Just point me to Bunker 3. I have the key to the blast door, which is directly across from our hideout, and a map you might find useful. Get my people back and I will put you in touch with Nicolette. Okay, so yeah, we need to find Beth Duclair because she has, uh... We are surrounded. We don't have much time. She has ties still with the Illuminati, and they are whom we are trying to find, ultimately, because... Tracer Tong really gets a hard-on for the fucking Illuminati. They are holding our comrades prison. We can't let them discover our hideout. Who are you? I came to help. Majestic Triumph took my mother prisoner. I'm on my way to find her right now. I hope she's okay. Me too. Uh, JC's so great with kids. It's awesome. We are not prepared to fight a war. Right, so this is Bunker 3. There's no plaque on the wall that tells you that. Looks like a chance to take out a team of MJ-12 troopers, but choose your head. We don't want the hostages getting caught in the crossfire. Wow, I wouldn't want to be that guy. Alright. We'll leave that crate there for the time being. Oh. What the hell, let's blow it up. Agent Heller, we've added a login for you to the Catacomb Security Network. While still incomplete, it's being extended every day. We should have the majority of the tunnels completely wide within the next three months. Within six months. Login Heller, password Ragnarok. Again, I'm pleased to know that you and MJ12 will be working closely with us to eradicate the silhouette infestation from Paris. 
please update me on a daily basis with your surveillance reports and any additional items or information you may require. Another World War II bunker. No sign of MJ-12. Maybe it's vacant. Hmm, maybe it is Tong. Maybe you can shut the fuck up. Pretty sick of your transmissions by now. If you got nothing useful to say, then don't say anything. Get out. I was here first. Sorry, just looking around. Aren't you afraid of the commandos? They better not come back here. I am not moving again. Right. You tell them that. At least I get away with something. Want a med kit? I stole three. Or what about those poison darts? 600 for a med kit, 200 for the darts. They move me out to make room for military supplies. If it ain't a weapon mod, I'm not interested. Maybe later. Maybe later. Yeah, maybe later. about a multi-pass. Oh. Hello? Whoever's out there is in serious trouble. That's him. Great. JC, you stand in a fire barrel, you gotta keep your mouth shut, man. Fucking hell, didn't hurt that much. Alright, some flare darts. They're probably one of the most useless items in the game. You shoot them from your crossbow, and it essentially is meant to light up the area, but it's so fucking useless. We'll come back to this box later. I don't know, we've run out of bioelectric energy. Luckily, there's a repair bot right here. But shit, fucking dicks, the door's locked. So, how are we gonna get through it? Oh no, instant death electricity, that's no good. Maybe we can push a barrel over here. Step on the skirting here, and then jump on the barrel and over the top. Oh my god. That is some Half-Life tier problem solving right there.
All right, now these TNT crates are a bit of a red herring because you really don't want to be shooting these because you'll just end up blowing yourself up. So we'll hug them in the corners and we'll also try and get this away as well. Now the aim is to try and throw a lamb at such a distance that it blows up the door but doesn't blow up the repair bot and also doesn't catch you in the blast with these TNT crates. Alright, good luck. Oh yes, success! <laughs> oh wow. Oh, during my practice run it took me about 20 tries. Got it first go now. Fuck yes. And the repair bot fixes the electricity. So... Now, uh, what you could do is use the lockpicks on the door here. Release the repair bot, it fixes this um, broken machine, and then you can walk back here and pick up all the items. But if you do it in reverse order like I did, you save a lot of lockpicks and a lot of resources in general. So, fuck yeah. Wow. That was... That was pretty good, but it's not worth dwelling on. Alright, we'll wait for the repair bot to recharge, because I'm going to need that extra 25% because the next part is really, really tough. Fucking hell, I always do that. Alright. There is a hole in the wall here which you can use to crawl through here. Oh, Tong. NJ-12 squads have set up a base camp in this old World War II bunker. This is probably where you'll find the hostages. Yep, thanks for that. That's awesome. So, how about we send a spy drone out here just to make sure. Alright, there's a commando. And two guards around this side, and another commando. Something's in here. Reading's all over the scale. What's the deal? What's the deal with security cameras? The false reading. Whoops. Something's in here. Gotta remember to pick my dart up off the wall there. Alright. Must have been a glitch. Reading's all over the scale. What's the deal? What's the deal with getting shot in the face? Alright. There you go. Not that he got shot in the face, so... Got a sword in the face, but there you go. Alright, so already I've done this a lot better than I did it last time. Now, we want to recharge our electricity again, because now we're going to go into the base and see if we can't wipe out everyone in there because it's going to be pretty tough for the hostages to escape if there's about 15 troops fucking standing in the way. Oh fuck, someone's opened the front door. Oh, 
Oh, the camera's reset. Fucking hell. Alright, looks like we're going back in the hole. Ugh. Nothing here now. Nothing here now. Well, you're about to get a dart in the face. Come on. There we go. There we go. So, yeah, it's pretty lame, but if you just hide in this hole here, they're pretty easy to deal with. The problem's going to be getting around the other side and taking out the rest of them. But I think I've got a plan for how to do that. Is that guy unconscious yet? Probably, it's been a few minutes. <laughs> a few minutes, I mean, uh, it's been a few seconds. Fucking hell. Um... This way, yes. Now we want to be careful not to make too much noise coming out of here. Oh shit. Cloak is our best friend at this point. Nice ass. Whoops. I forgot they explode. <laughs> the alarm to go off. I mean, uh, to stop. There we go. And we'll swim back under. So yeah, this is probably a little boring and also a little dark. Uh, probably can't see shit. But yeah, this uh, little swimming tunnel is gonna be crucial for you. Oh. Exponentially multiplying Commandos. Visual. Unidentified suspect. That was fucking close. I thought he was going around the other way. Must have been a yeah, it must have been a glitch. <laughs> hey there, buddy. everyone here taken care of. Fuck. What are the odds that the camera reactivated just as I stood there? What the hell? That's okay though because there is a security terminal here that we can use. Hella Ragnarok. Alright. Uh... No, we want that off. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Fuck you, buddy.
Well, I really didn't think that the commando would uh, just run past the turret to attack me. That's kind of shit. There we go. Upon arrival in Paris, you are to interface with Inspector Gilby Gabilly of the Met Metropolitan Police, your operator for the duration of this mission. Aid Gabilly in any way possible to eradicate lingering elements of either Silhouette or the Illuminati. Secondary priority is the acquisition of any information concerning the whereabouts of Morgan Everett, Tracer Tong, Alex Jacobson or JC Denton. Any such information is to be sent to Walton Simons directly and immediately. We have reason to believe that Denton may be travelling to Paris in an attempt to ally himself with the surviving Illuminati, a situation that should be prevented with all due prejudice. And why is that? Why do they want me to stay away from Morgan Everett? Okay, there's still two soldiers in this fucking place. I reckon I can deal with them. Oh, what? These two guys merged with each other. Fuck. Alright, there we go. Place is clear. It's a lot easier than it fucking was last time, that's for sure. We have to get moving. Okie dokie, let's go. Check our skills. Yes, we now have enough to buy lock picking level three. And I really want that weapon mod. Um let's drop the Zyme. Oh. Gotta drop it one at a time. One at a time. That was a terrible pun, I'm sorry. We're putting that into the spider gun. And we'll pick up our precious, precious drugs once more. And everything has all been taken out here. So now we just gotta backtrack to the... Well, first I'll get the repair bot. And then I'll backtrack to the silhouette bunker. So I'll cut you back in then. Alright, welcome back. Now we just gotta find Chad again. They're back. They sure are. We made it. Yep. Thank you for saving our comrades. That's perfectly okay. I freed the hostages. Wonderful. Where are they? Both of them made it to the hideout safely. I made sure of it. Excellent. I cannot believe our good fortune. Now, you wanted to contact Nicolette? Yes. You might catch her at Club La Porte de l'Enfer. I tried to tell her it's not safe, but ever since her mother's assassination, she has been careless. She goes out every night as though daring the assassins to show their faces. A silhouette hangout? Among other things. But you can't get there at night. The roads are blocked. What about the tunnels? The catacombs do not go that far. You might try the sewers, though. They can be reached through the rear blast door. Is it locked? Unfortunately, MJ-12 closed it before the raid. Maybe you can find a key on one of the soldiers. I already picked up that key. Thanks again for the help. Then why did you ask if it was locked, dumbass? God damn it, he's fucking stupid sometimes. Alright, there's nothing in that cabinet now that's worth anything. Silhouette. You did it! Yeah, yeah. Alright, so now we want to just go back to the sewers, so I may cut you in there, or maybe I'll just... Keep you locked to the screen on my way. Why not? Uh, I opened up the chest that I said I'd come back to earlier, and inside was two packets of darts and a flare dart. So, a lot of good that was. I just went in a big fucking circle. Alright. I will definitely cut you back in now. Okay, here we are again. And this place is just one big fucking maze, but here we go. In the sewers. Oh goody, I love sewer levels. I'm sure you do as well. Everyone loves sewer levels. There's a newspaper on the ground here. It's sanitary. 
Uh, earlier today, the police raided the catacombs, entering through Donfleur Rochereau, Port Royal, Trocadero, and a number of other unidentified locations in an attempt to round up elements of the terrorist group Silhouette. Sources within the Metropolitan Police Department indicated that since the institution of martial law, the number of terrorist incidents has declined, but Silhouette still remains active in its so-called campaign of true lies. Far from being a harmless group of reactionaries, Silhouette presents a clear and ongoing threat to the public welfare, said Inspector Gabilly, currently leading the case. Despite extensive surveillance prior to the raid, however, police found minimal evidence of Silhouette's presence instead capturing a number of drug dealers, prostitutes, and other, not the prostitutes, and other suspected criminals. All in all, we consider the operation a success, insisted Gabilly. That's such a, I'm pronouncing that so wrongly, aren't I? We've made a strong statement that Paris above all, above all below, will not be a haven to radicals and thieves. God damn it, reading those newspapers is like fucking going back to school. I think these tunnels connect to the sewers. You're going the right way. Thank you, Tom. I'm sure I could fucking figure that out for myself. You are a genius beyond genius. This hole looks like it should have something in it, but it doesn't. So, just to let you know, in case you decide to yell at me for not exploring everywhere. These sewers can take you anywhere in the Champs Elysees, where you will find the club. Thank you, Tom. Oh my god. Above, I'm showing MJ-12 troops and the Paris police. Also some bots. The police won't bother you, but stay away from the troopers. Also some bots. Some bots. He's very Chinese, Tong. Bots. I'm showing some bots. He's like the most uh, Chinese guy in the world. Uh, Hong Kong's in China, right? Yeah, I think it is. Alright, cool. This will be the end of the episode then. So, uh, we will break out of the sewers and back onto the streets of Paris in order to find the nightclub, wherein we will hopefully find Nicolette Duclair, who can lead us to Morgan Everett. And then that will be Paris whoop-de-doo done. Okay, coolio, I'll see you next time.